Mexico with a cumulative amount of $26 billion. To talk about the trade between both countries, the President of the Japanese Chamber of Commerce and Industry in Mexico, Mr. Yun Umemora. Hello, Mr. Thank you. Thank you for coming to have this interview. What is the panorama of trade relations between Mexico and Japan? Well, since uh, 2010, in the Bajio area, uh, we had uh, many automotive companies uh, coming into Mexico. Uh, 2013, we had uh, 679 companies, but after that, many automotive uh, industries invested. 2018, in, uh, our Japanese uh, companies became reach 1,228 companies increased. Um, from Asia, country of the Asia, Japan is number one uh, investor to Mexico. So we increased 29.3% last year, 2018. So we are very uh, actively, our members are investing in Mexico. Okay, so how did the Japanese Chamber of Commerce take place in Mexico? Okay, um, this uh, chamber originally established 1950 and then uh, 1964 we had the official uh, chamber to establish. Uh, first time we had only 30 companies, now we have uh, 534 companies okay. in, in the Mexico. Okay, so what objectives does the chamber support? Uh, main our object is that uh, uh, promote our relation, uh, especially uh, economic interchange between Mexico and Japan. That's our uh, objectives. Okay, so Mr. John, what is being done to boost business opportunities between both countries? Well, we have uh, between uh, Mexican government and Japan government has a committee we call Improve Business Environment. So we are joining uh, this committee and then uh, propose from our improvement ideas or expanding uh, trade ideas to Mexico government and also Japanese uh, government. Okay. Mr. What role do Japanese companies play in the Mexican economy? Well, uh, recently in the Mexico, um, automotive industry is uh, expanding, especially uh, Japanese maker. We have a uh, total share in the production side. All uh, Japanese uh, makers production share became 32%. And also, um, sales side, um, all Japanese make is reached around 40%. So we are still giving more expansion for Mexico automotive uh, industries. Okay. How will trade ties between the nations be stranger in the coming years? Well, still we have uh, uh, some uh, signing for USMCA and also we call the CPTPP, new, new TPP, we call TPP 11, already established. So, and then next year, Tokyo, we have uh, Olympics and also um, we have some uh, fair communicating uh, between uh, Mexican uh, people. So we are promoting some uh, Japanese uh, uh, members information giving to uh, Mexican uh, consumers and Mexican people. That's a real funny. Okay. What are the main challenges to face? Well, so we have uh, many uh, unknown factors. Uh, like U.S., China, 
trade uh, some uh, relations or a couple other economic uh, risks, but uh, still we are um, uh, doing very became to became more better relation between Japan and Mexico. Okay, you want something more that you want to add? Okay, um, in between Mexico and Japan, we have a really long history. Uh, 400 years ago, um, Mexican uh, government, Nueva Espanol and Japan, is trying to uh, have a trade. And then we had a uh, uh, couple uh, exchange from Japan to Mexico. Uh, we are sending some ships. Not the Galeon ships by helping by uh, Mexican uh, government people. That's our very start. And also 1888, Mexico government is the first government we trade, agreed, very fair uh, trade uh, agreement. It's the first country in that uh, Western country we uh, made very fair trade agreement. So we are Japanese people very appreciated. Basically Japanese people was very, very likes Mexican cultures and also Mexican people. So many our chamber, member of chamber is, uh, likes to come and stay here feeling very wonderful day-to-day uh, -day, uh, activities. So uh, basically, Japanese people is a very, very good adjusted to, to stay in Mexico. And then the people between the relation between Mexican people and Japanese people is that's a very good. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate the interview that the president of the Japanese Chamber of Commerce and Industry in Mexico gave us. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much.